93-year-old Essie Tiernan is from the Knoll in North Dublin. She was brought from a nursing home on Wednesday afternoon to Beaumont Hospital's emergency department at 3 o'clock with age-related issues. Her grandniece Michelle Cleary said today she finally got a bed at 8 o'clock yesterday evening after 29 hours on a trolley. She um, was very distressed for the time she was there and I was with her there for most of the time and pleaded for a bed and uh, was given a lot of excuses during the day but she uh, had a very traumatic time there and I was very upset for her as well. Mrs Tiernan remains at Beaumont. The hospital said it acknowledged and regretted the difficult conditions experienced by patients and staff in the emergency department. It said Beaumont has one of the busiest emergency departments in the country and looks to treat all patients with dignity and care. It also said that 33 inpatient ward beds are not available due to essential refurbishment. Meanwhile, the Irish Association for Emergency Medicine said that patients of all ages suffer this fate on a daily basis. I can guarantee you that there are a number of patients over, 90s to the, over 90 years of age today who are on trolleys all over this country. It's an everyday event and unfortunately it's getting worse, not better. The association has also commended Tala Hospital consultant Dr James Gray for highlighting a similar case there this week. I think Dr Jim Gray has done society a favour by highlighting the plight of this unfortunate man who's detained for 29 hours in a trolley. That is torture by any definition. And the response of the hospital by investigating the circumstances as to how the information got into the public domain misses the point. The association said that the unacceptable has become a normal part of the hospital system. Fergal Bowers, RTE News.